is Chantal today, Senior Editor on Mobile Commerce Daily. So uh, the big news in mobile commerce last week is that the uh, major payments platforms are, you know, continuing to sort of tweak what they've got out there already to bring in added convenience, but then they're also, um, with mobile payments just not sort of taking off as, as quickly as expected still, um, you know, they're already looking ahead to next generation solutions and they're getting out there and testing those. Uh, so, you know, we saw that um, Virgin America, Fandango, and, and Pizza Hut are among the first merchants to be taking advantage of Visa Checkout's new um, swipeable uh, checkout button for mobile um, that allows users to make a purchase by by simply swiping, um, thereby you know sort of simplifying the process and, and reflecting just the the, the growing interest. Uh, growing use of the swiping action on mobile to enable commerce and other transactions. Um, we also saw that MasterCard is using the uh, Arnold Palmer, Palmer Invitational to test a few new mobile payment strategies. Uh, one uh, enables users to um, interact with a uh, commerce-enabled virtual, virtual reality experience and, and make a purchase. Um, it's also testing a wearable glove, um, which users simply tap at the point of sale to uh, purchase refreshments. We also saw that Amazon is the latest company to, uh, you know, sh some interest in facial recognition technology and the popularity of selfies to authenticate mobile payments. Uh, the company has reportedly filed for a patent that would enable users to smile or blink at a phone uh, to authenticate their identity, thereby sort of making it easier to make a purchase than having to enter in a PIN. Uh, we're going to see just a lot more of this experimentation in 2016, I think. Um, mobile payments just haven't caught on uh, as, as quickly as expected, and the platforms are going to be out there looking for the solutions that are going to really get consumers and retailers uh, excited, could tip the scales and, and, and you know, drive the, the mass adoption that uh, is expected to happen at some point.